random video challenge. We are doing this, uh, oh, who is it? Dave Cad Blogs. It is a random video challenge where we do a random topic generator, and we're gonna see how we can do. Are, we, are you gonna do one? Am I gonna do one? Or are we gonna do it together? We're gonna do it together. Okay. It's kind of cool. He said, um, he posted his link to this thing, and he said for everybody to post video responses. So that's what we're doing. So here's a link to his video. Where he posted about doing this. Okay. So this random topic generator just tells you different things to talk about. And the first topic is... Wait, what category should we do? All categories? Or... Let's just do all. Let's see what happens. Okay, ready? Remember. So the first topic is... Modern or retro video games. I'll send this one your way. <laughs> I am a... Xbox Modern Warfare... Call of Duty Black Ops. Hit me up. I will even put my gamer tag oh in the description oh so y'all can hit me up and shoot my brains out. But I do like Tetris. Yeah, me too. Okay, next topic. Monody? What does that mean? Okay, next topic. <laughs> Lying to your parents. I, again, will send that one your way. <laughs> I'm just um, I have Sorry, done, I'm like every teenager, told little white lies to my parents. Um, Big red lies. Like taking the car out at night and that kind of stuff. Mom, I hope you're not watching. I'll say lying to my parents is um, I pretty much didn't. I mean, you know, everybody, everybody's got little white lies they tell about things, but... I was just not, and I'm still not a good liar. Colin will tell you. You're not. He can pretty much tell if I'm lying. I don't like to lie, and I don't, I don't know. I'm not perfect or anything. <laughs> <laughs> but I just don't like, I'm not good at She's it. She's not I don't good like at it. it. She's not good at and it. And I don't like it. It makes me uncomfortable. Number three. The right time to stop schooling. <laughs> you can direct that one at me. <laughs> Obviously. She needs to be done with school six years ago. Not because she's a <coughs> cuckoo, but because she's a cuckoo, she just keeps going and going and going. I say the right time to stop schooling is when you feel like you are satisfied with the amount of education you have to um, achieve the career goals that you desire. And for me, that means I am 27 and still in school, but I'm almost done! Woo! No! Okay. Things to do with your dog! We're pretty good at this. Right now, she's scratching the door down, so the first one would be a walk. Uh, the second one would be the dog park. I don't know if any of y'all are familiar with dog parks. We weren't really up to knowledge or up to speed with them when we first got her. But no, recently, we had never even like been to, when somebody said dog park, I thought it meant like, you take your dog to the park and there's people there like playing. Yeah. But it's like a specific park, all fenced in. Um, and there's like dog water bowls and stuff and it's just cool like way to get your dog out and give them something to do So they're not just sitting in the house all day um, Another thing would be putting cute clothes on them. No, I'm just kidding. Boo. never dress your dog. No, do if they'll let you. Ada just doesn't like it. Uh, doggy daycare uh, It's kind of like children's daycare, but for dogs and it is something we said we would never do, or we didn't say that. We were just like, yeah, that's, we were really that's dumb. Like, why would you do that? That's a waste of money. But for little Miss Pris here, she um, just needs it. Like, she loves to be social with other dogs. And we get home, and she's like all hyped up and stuff. And so the place we used to go to, their theory was that your dog will come home as tired as you are after a long day at work. Number five. Your worst enemy. Your worst enemy. Like a person or uh, I think it could be anything. Uh... My worst enemy would be selfishness. Huh. <laughs> That's interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm always in the back of my head thinking about me when I should be thinking about others. That's, that's like, not always true. That's like the church response. But that's not always true either. You do think about other people a lot. You, th you think about other people yeah. a lot. I would say mine, one of my worst enemies is my lack of self-confidence sometimes. I know that Colin's like, that's stupid because you no, always... No, I agree with no, that, but You, you need to like, think... just be like, what's up, you, Tim? <laughs> but probably because somebody 
talk therapy all the time. <laughs> um, but I mean, you pro- I was saying you think I was stupid because I'm always like, I always think I'm always right about things, which that's different. If I think I'm right about something, that's different than like feeling confident about myself. That's just being a wife. Exactly. But self confidence probably for me because I always feel like I say stupid things and do stupid things. And you're like, yeah, you do. <laughs> hey, uh, Dave, Cat Blogs, this was pretty fun. Thanks for the opportunity. Uh, we will post the video response and check you out some more. Yeah, good stuff. Oh, and hey guys, if y'all want to do this, we'll put a link right here. It's somewhere right in here. To the website. <laughs> That's so annoying when we do that. <laughs> um, to do the random, what was it? The, random topic generator. Yeah, to topic generator. About. It's and really fun though. Post a video response to this video as well, and it's like it just or just chain reacts. You just boom, boom, boom. Did it and then y'all do it. Yeah, it chain reacts, it blows up okay. in your face. It'd be cool to see some <laughs> other people do it and see what topics y'all get. So do it.